So the Makerspace project is all about unlocking human potential. The Makerspace is a place where there's equipment that people can come and use and the idea is that it's open to anyone, open to everyone, the price is made so that everyone can access it and then provides machinery that normally is not accessible, accessible only if you work in those industries. So creating a space where you can come make things, be creative with machinery that is not always easily accessible to everyone. Space offers a corporate side as well. So we do corporate team building where you bring your team in and we help them to make something. So lots of teams think they're not creative, so we aid them in trying to be as creative as they can in a controlled environment, which encourages people to try something new. We also run exhibitions. We illustrate to people what is possible, show people machinery that they don't see every day, like your laser cutters and your 3D printers, so that they are introduced to the idea and they want to come in and maybe try it. Like just from going from a team building, uh, which we did, which was our first step into the makerspace, all the way through to like a pretty important prototype that makerspace helped us develop. It's always been there's something new all the time. You know, you're always learning something. So I think. It's just a catalyst for growth. I kind of had this ability to make things, but I didn't really do it too often until I really like moved away from the farm and got to the city where all of a sudden I didn't really have tools to do anything. Through a series of events, I ended up at the Makerspace and just saw all these things. Never heard of a laser cutter, never heard of 3D printing or anything like that. My first initial draw to it was like, wow, they have like all the tools I need. Basically, my passion for making just like ignited because all of a sudden I had all these tools that were like, like catalysts for making. I think the definition of humanity is that we are creative, so we find ways to solve problems. And this becomes a new medium for people to explore their creativity. We teach tools that unlock potential to make things for yourself. So the technology allows people to make things of as good quality as what can be made in a factory. I quite like the idea of the community, of the sharing, the space where everybody chips in, everybody does it together, everybody does their part, so it's not just you on your own. My favourite part about the Make Space is definitely the people, the vibe, the way that uh, when you get here, you know, everyone's doing something or busy with something, they're on a mission. And so it inspires me to, you know, get stuck in and get busy. So I, I get excited about doing something for the first time. Uh, research and development and innovation is what really excites me and this environment of the Makerspace allows me to do that. Once I've learned something or once I've taught myself something, then I just want to teach other people how to do it so they can use it to make products and unlock potential. Our primary benefit is to be part of a community of makers, people who are excited to learn new skills and to share those skills. Somebody might be good at electronics and someone else might be good at art, somebody might be good at making skateboards and together we can create this beautiful collaborative environment where people can learn new skills, be inspired by each other. From there, obviously, there's access to the technology and to the equipment, which could be quite a benefit for people who can't afford it. But generally, the main benefit actually comes in with the friendships and the relationships that are made and the learning environment that's created. The Makerspace allows me to basically live out my dream. I get to do what I feel I was born to do and it allows me to make a radical impact and change other people's lives.